expert warns Haz and Meg conflicts with Royal's push to climax due to Meghan's thoughtless move. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's criticisms of the royal family could further divisions, royal expert Rebecca English warned. Meghan and Harry's tension with the royal family appears to be unresolved as a royal expert claims this week that the firm will be relieved if the Sussexes don't attend Prince Philip's memorial. Ingrid Seward said, I think if they choose not to come then everyone will breathe a sigh of relief. It is Thanksgiving for Prince Philip and we don't want it turning into the Harry and Meghan show. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex said they do not feel safe coming to the UK. And Harry, now living in the US, has threatened legal action against the Home Office for refusing to let him pay for police protection. Harry and Meghan have been open about how they struggled with royal life, but another expert warned that their criticisms of the royal family could lead to a tipping point. Ms English said, the palace have always gone with the never complain, never explain approach. Can we really expect that to carry on? Surely there will be a tipping point? She continued, the palace genuinely don't want to get drawn into a public slanging match with Harry and Meghan. That said, they, Harry and Meghan, are poking the bear a lot, and people are right to wonder whether there will be a tipping point. After the Sussexes' interview with Oprah Winfrey last year, it became clear just how big the divide was between the couple and the rest of the royal family is. In the interview, Meghan alleged that a senior member of the royal family raised concerns over her son's skin color before he was born. Harry also claimed that Charles and his brother William are trapped in the royal family. Following the airing of the interview, Buckingham Palace issued a statement saying the Queen was saddened by the allegations but added that some recollections may vary. Harry and Meghan are now focused on their life in the US, but the Duke could be dealt one more blow which would make his exit from the firm irreversible, according to a source. They told the Daily Mail that Harry would face no going back to his former royal life if he is axed as a councillor of state. Queen Elizabeth II has yet to see or hold her great-granddaughter from Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. This is why she is, reportedly, begging for her grandson to compromise. As the disputes continue to develop, Queen Elizabeth II, allegedly, feels heartbroken that she might not get to see her great-grandchildren from Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. She is said to be worrying that the Sussex pair will keep the children away from her if she does not figure out a way to get him what he wants. The insiders continued that it has become a devastating matter for the Queen upon hearing the idea of never meeting the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's daughter. In the end, though, she, reportedly, hopes that the family can find a solution to the ongoing matter. It remains unclear how or where the anonymous informants obtained the information about Queen Elizabeth II. No evidence has come to light to verify the claims. It is true, however, that, through a representative, Prince Harry stated he and his family are unable to fly back to his home country if the disputes over police protection are not resolved. Meanwhile, the Home Office is reportedly refusing to back down, according to the Mail on Sunday via Express UK. A security source explained that the terms of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's exit were clear when they left their positions as senior working royals. The same insider noted that the matter is the same for all members of the public. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are not able to hire armed cops at will, no matter how much they offer to pay. As for Queen Elizabeth II, she has yet to break her silence or release official announcements about the matter. The same, also, applies to the rest of the British royal family, applies, 